my earliest memories are of playing with paint and crayons and just drawing all the time. And as an only child, I had the, the space and the, the quietness to, uh, to be able to shut myself away in my room. I've always loved drawing and started collecting books from an early age and looking at the old masters and, and trying to replicate their techniques and, and trying out different methods. I was so excited about going around art shops and buying new materials and just discovering the, the world of, of an artist. So there's never been any question of, of what I wanted to do for a career. Art was always my favourite subject at school and I went on to do A-levels and then went to do graphic design and after that vowed I'd never have a proper job, so to speak. And worked freelance for probably about 10 years. When I found out I was pregnant, it was a great opportunity to take a year out of work and develop a portfolio of pieces to take round to some local galleries. At the same time, I was decorating the nursery for Sam and was looking for some work to put on his wall. I couldn't find anything I particularly liked, so wanted to also add my personal touch. I was walking in the fields here and saw the cows and thought, I'll, I'll paint him a cow. So that's where it started really. I wanted something that would make him smile and keep him company when I'm not in the room. And he's still got in his bedroom now. transformed quite a lot over the years. Initially they had tissue paper all over the cow, even on the nose. Now the nose is very very finely painted and shaded so the tissue paper wouldn't have enabled me to do that because it's quite a rough surface to paint on. The eyes have changed dramatically too. There's so much expression in them that I can create just by putting two simple white dots on them that will change the character of the cow completely and I felt a little bit restricted by that with the old style that I was using. There was also black edging around the cow itself to emphasise the fur, but now that's all done by hand too. 